But now it appears that the homeless are starting to gather under the bridge once again. Sierra Oshwin talked with city leaders about their concerns. She's live in Boise. Right, Natalie, it was just under a year ago that this area was considered an eyesore for many. It's much cleaner now, but as you can see, people are starting to congregate there once again. This is like, this is where the homeless people are. People are starting to gather in the area across the street from Rhodes Park again. I spoke with one of the homeless who says they notice it too. If you drive around town, you don't see anybody out there, but once you get towards here, you know where the homeless people are. Jeff Graves has been homeless off and on. He says that he takes advantage of the shelter services when they aren't full, but when they are, he has to head back out to the street. The city has worked for months to clear that area, so I asked when it would start to raise concern for them. Whenever we begin to see a congregation of people who are camping in, in, in large in, in groups, um, uh, that's when our real concern begins. That, that's when, when you start seeing larger groups of people um, living in an area where there is, are no resource, resources or, or facilities for them. Um, that's our real concern. The homeless I spoke with say they do notice a strong police presence. However, they think it's going to increase once Rhodes Park finally opens. Live in Boise, Sierra Oshran, KBOI 2 News.